ओके ओके सो हाई इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स इवनिंग एवरीबडी बचे इवनिंग एवरीबडी आई गेस वी नो इच अदर प्रेडी वेल आई एम डॉक्टर सुशांत सोनी एम बी बी एस मैम सी एम डी पैथोलॉजी रेजिडेंट हिमाटन कॉलेजी इम सेली सो लेट एस स्टार्ट लेट एस स्टार्ट विद अवर थ्री मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स विद रिस्पेक्ट टू नीट पी जी नाओ दिस इज अ स्पेशल सेशन दिस इज अ स्पेशल सेशन दिस इज अ सीरीज ऑफ सेशंस इन विच वील बी डिस्कसिंग आई एल कीप इट शॉर्ट एंड स्वीट थ्री टॉपिक्स थ्री टॉपिक्स पर सेशन सो लेट एस स्टार्ट ऑल दी सेशंस दे आर गोइंग टू बी एक्सट्रीमली हाई इंडिंग सो लेट एस स्टार्ट लेट एस स्टार्ट विद अवर फर्स्ट टॉपिक लेट एस स्टार्ट विद अवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन दैट इज अ टेन ईयर ओल्ड चाइल्ड प्रेजेंटेड विद पैलो एंड हिस्ट्री ऑफ ब्लड ट्रांसफ्यूजन टू मंथ्स बैक द चाइल्ड हैज अ वेरी हाई वेरी लो हिमोग्लोबिन high tlc low hemoglobin high tlc with presence of blas with presence of blas that means it is a case of acute leukemia these blas these blas they are cd 10 positive 19 positive 117 and 33 positive 10 19 117 and 33 what is the most likely diagnosis first i want you guys to tell me this what is the what is the most likely diagnosis 10 19 117 and 117 and 33 This is one of the questions in which students always have a confusion with respect to diagnosis. या तो हमें CD markers नहीं पता होते और we tend to misinterpret the question. So before we go further, before we go further, quickly let us have a look at the CD markers associated. Let us have a look at CD markers. Starting with B cell markers. Starting with B cell markers. Before Bombay, B cell markers. Pan B cell marker CD nineteen. Pan B cell marker CD nineteen. immature b cell marker where do b cells mature they mature in the bone marrow c pan b cell marker is cd19 it is positive on all the b cells immature b cell marker immature b cell marker cd10 when we were 10 years old we were immature by the age of 20 years we became slightly mature so mature b cell marker cd20 other markers other b cell markers are cd79a and cd22 b cell markers next t cell markers Where do the T cells mature in the thymus? So pan T cell marker, pan T cell marker CD3. Where does expression of CD3 come first? In the cytoplasm or the surface of the T cells? See, as the T cells mature in the thymus, first is the cytoplasmic expression of CD3, and gradually it comes onto the surface. So pan T cell marker, pan T cell marker cytoplasmic CD3, pan T cell marker cytoplasmic CD3. Others are four eight two five and seven. Next point, a special subtype of TALL. Special subtype is cortical TALL, which is CD one A positive. Special subtype of TALL is cortical TALL, which is CD one A positive. CD one A positive. Next, next category of markers are the myeloid markers. Next are the myeloid markers. I can divide myeloid markers into myeloid specific and myeloid associated. MPO. That is myeloperoxidase is a myeloid specific marker versus CD thirteen, thirty three and one one seven, which are myeloid associated markers. Specific means they are in a relationship versus associated with which, which are just friends. Thirteen, thirty three and one one seven myeloid associated markers. Next, NK cell marker, natural killer cell markers. NK cell markers CD sixteen and fifty six. Very very important. Sixteen and fifty six. Next, monocytic markers. Answer: Monocytic markers. Monocytic markers CD14 and 64. Which is the cytochemistry for monoblasts? Which is the cytochemistry for monoblasts? Monoblasts they are NAC positive. They are non-specific esterases. They are NAC positive. So the youngest and the oldest, 14 and 64, are monocytic markers. 14 and 64 are monocytic markers. The middle two, 16 and 56, these are the NK cell markers. Middle two are the NK cell markers. Next, stem cell markers. Stem cell marker CD thirty four. Of course, CD thirty four. Other stem cell markers are CD ninety nine. Others are CD ninety nine and TDT. TDT stands for terminal deoxytransferase. CD ninety nine, CD ninety nine and TDT. TDT stands for terminal deoxytransferase, which is particularly positive in TLL, which is particularly positive in TLL. Next, CD ninety nine. Other other than blood cancers, CD ninety nine is positive in which bone tumor? This was a huge hint. Answer: 
सी डी नाइनटी नाइन इट इज पॉजिटिव इन विच बोन ट्यूमर दैट इज इविंग सार्कोमा सी डी नाइनटी नाइन विच इट इज पॉजिटिव इन इविंग सार्कोमा इविंग सार्कोमा दैट इज ट्रांसलोकेशन इलेवन ट्वेंटी टू ट्रांसलोकेशन इलेवन ट्वेंटी टू फ्यूजन ट्रांसक्रिप्ट विच इज द फ्यूजन ट्रांसक्रिप्ट फॉर्म इविंग सार्कोमा ना ई डब्ल्यू एस आर वन एफ एल आई वन फ्यूजन ट्रांसक्रिप्ट दैट इज विच इज द प्रोटीन फॉर्म इविंग सार्कोमा सो ई डब्ल्यू एस आर वन एफ एल आई एफ एल आई वन टोटली एग्रीड सी डी नाइनटी नाइन इज नेवर बी नास्ट एज अ स्टेम सेल मार्केट इन हिमेटोलॉजी बट इट हैज बीन आस्ट वंस और ट्वाइस विद इविंग सार्कोमा सो दैट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट स्टेम सेल मार्कर्स लास्टली विच वॉज द माइलोइड स्पेसिफिक मार्कर एम पी ओ माइलो माइलो परॉक्सीडेस इट वॉज द माइलोइड स्पेसिफिक मार्कर बट सम ए एम एल्स दे आर एम पी ओ नेगेटिव ऑल्सो ऑल एम एल्स आर नॉट एम पी ओ पॉजिटिव दे कैन बी एम पी ओ नेगेटिव ऑल्सो लाइक एम जीरो एम सिक्स एंड एम सेवन एम पी ओ नेगेटिव ए एम एल एम पी ओ नेगेटिव ए एम एल एम जीरो एम सिक्स एंड एम सेवन एम सिक्स एम सिक्स इज कॉल्ड एज एक्यूट एरथ्रोलुकीमिया इट इज एम पी ओ नेगेटिव एम सिक्स एम सिक्स इज कॉल्ड एज एक्यूट एरथ्रोलुकीमिया सो विच मार्कर इज पॉजिटिव इन एम सिक्स एम सिक्स इट इज सी डी थर्टी सिक्स सी डी सेवेंटी वन एंड ग्लाइकोफोरिन ए पॉजिटिव सी डी थर्टी सिक्स सेवेंटी वन एंड ग्लाइकोफोरिन ए थर्टी सिक्स सेवेंटी वन एंड ग्लाइकोफोरिन ए पॉजिटिव वर्सेज एम सेवन वर्सेज एम सेवन एम सेवन विच इज कॉल्ड एज एक्यूट मेगा कैरियोसेटिक लुकीमिया एम सेवन विच इज कॉल्ड एज एक्यूट मेगा कैरियोसेटिक एक्यूट मेगा कैरियोसेटिक लुकीमिया एम सेवन सो विच आर द मॉकर्स एसोसिएटेड सी डी फोर्टी वन एंड सी डी सिक्सटी वन पॉजिटिव एज सच यू नो दैट एम सेवन इट इज द लीस्ट कॉमन ए एम एल फैप क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ ए एम एल एम जीरो टू एम सेवन एम सेवन इज द लीस्ट इट इज द लीस्ट कॉमन इट इज द लीस्ट कॉमन ए एम एल सो एम सेवन एक्यूट मेगा कैरियोसेटिक लुकीमिया सी डी फोर्टी वन एंड सिक्सटी वन पॉजिटिव this was a master list this was a master list of the cd markers associated a very very important topic this was the first topic i wanted to discuss the list of cd markers b cell t cell myeloid markers myeloid markers nk cell markers natural killer cell markers monocytic markers stem cell markers and mpo negative aml m0 m6 and m7 please go through this so so coming to our question now coming to our question which are the markers which are positive in this child which are the markers which are positive in this child he is 19 positive 10 positive so whatever it is it is 100% a case of bll it is 100% a case of bll p for bombay bll next they are 117 and 33 positive what are 117 and cd 33 117 and 33 they are myeloid associated markers they are not myeloid specific they are myeloid associated markers myeloid associated so answer in this case becomes this is a case of bll this is not a case of aml or mpal mpal is mixed phenotypic acute leukemia mixed phenotypic means two types of acute leukemia are occurring together this is not a case of bll with aml mpal means bll with aml mixed phenotypic two types of acute leukemias were occurring together no this was a case of bll in this question in this question when mpo positivity is added suppose the examiner adds it is also mpo positive then my answer will shift to mpal then my answer will shift to four not otherwise so this was a case of bll this was a case of bll first point so this was about cd markers this was about cd markers next point the second important topic i know i will i have taken one topic of oncohematology and the next of general path this is because the questions in the exam will also be mixed the next extremely important topic that you have to know with respect to inflammation are the chemotactic agents i can divide chemotactic agents into endogenous and exogenous chemotactic agents these are the substances which help in chemotaxis exogenous chemotactic agents are bacterial and viral products which are the endogenous chemotactic agents answer which complement protein which complement protein c3a c3b c5a c5b answer bache which complement protein c5a c5a other chemotactic agents are leukotriene b4 ltb4 leukotriene b4 
interleukin 1 interleukin 8 and tnf alpha others are others are interleukin 1 interleukin 8 and tnf alpha 1 to 5 most potent endogenous chemotactic agent out of these five which is the most potent i totally agree complement factor c5a it was c3a c3b c5a c5b the complement factor which is most potent is c5a overall the most potent chemotactic agent leukotine b4 overall overall most potent chemotactic agent leukotine b4 next interleukin 1 what is its main role i need not even tell you that it is the most potent pyrogen it causes fever this has been asked so many times that they do not even ask this now what is asked is followed by the second most pyrogen most potent pyrogen interleukin 6 followed by pg2 prostaglandin e2 this was your last year's need pg question next interleukin 8 what is the main role of interleukin 8 in the body interleukin 8 it is responsible for development of ards acute respiratory distress syndrome ards before covid 19 happened there were other diseases in the world other than COVID-19 also firstly and there were non-COVID causes of ARDS of course. All the non-COVID causes of ARDS, the main cytokine associated is interleukin 8. Which is the main cytokine in COVID-19 induced ARDS? Answer. I am waiting for your answer on that. Next, next is TNF-alpha. It is the main mediator of sepsis. That is infection of the whole body, sepsis. Next, my question is which, of, which is the COVID-19 associated ARDS? which is the main cytokine associated with COVID-19 ARDS, interleukin-6. COVID-19 ARDS, interleukin-6. Increased levels of which are poor prognosis in COVID-19. So I can rephrase this as, I can rephrase this as interleukin-6 has three main roles. Firstly, it is the cytokine in COVID-19 ARDS. Next, you already know that it is the second most potent pyrogen. Most potent is interleukin-1 followed by interleukin-6. It is the second most potent pyrogen. And lastly, it plays a major role in which malignancies? Interleukin-6 overexpression is the main pathogenesis of multiple myeloma. It is the main pathogenesis. It is the main pathogenesis of multiple myeloma. That is a plasma cell neoplasm. The whole pathogenesis of multiple myeloma is based on interleukin-6 overexpression. Put a star. Other than multiple myeloma, it also plays a role in pathogenesis of which other malignancy of the body? Liver cancer. Liver has two main cells, hepatocytes and biliary epithelium. Malignancy of hepatocytes is HCC. Malignancy of biliary epithelium is cholangiocarcinoma. It plays a role. It plays a role in cholangiocarcinoma. cholangiocarcinoma. This is with respect to interleukin-6. This is with respect to interleukin-6. Next, Bache, it's on my telegram now. COVID uh, pathology PDF. Uh, not the PDF, not the PDF, but the session is on YouTube. The session is on YouTube. COVID-19, of course, it is important. The PDF is not there, Bache. The session is there. Next, I agree, the session is there. Lastly, lastly, which are the cells associated with type 1 hypersensitivity? Again, an important topic. Type 1 hypersensitivity, the cells associated main cell is mast cells main cell is mast cell followed by eosinophils basophils and t cells which is the stain used for mast cells which is the stain used stain used for mast cells toluidine blue stain used for mast cells toluidine blue most potent activator of eosinophils e is the fifth alphabet now eosinophils interleukin 5 followed by interleukin 4 interleukin 5 interleukin 5 followed by interleukin 4 Versus basophils, most potent activator is interleukin 3 followed by interleukin 4. See, B, basophil, it's the second alphabet. Most potent activator is interleukin 3 followed by interleukin 4. These are the, these are the main points. These are the main points with respect to chemotactic agents and the other cytokines associated. This was a list of chemotactic agents. Under no circumstance, under no circumstance, confuse the chemotactic agents with opsonization agents. Which are the opsonization agents? Which complement protein? C3B. C5A is a chemotactic agent. C3B is an opsonization agent. Others are menos. What is opsonization agent? They are the substances 
which make the bacteria tasty for phagocytosis. So C3B, menos, menos, menos is present on bacterial cell wall. It makes the bacteria tasty for phagocytosis. FC fragment of IgG, FC fragment of IgG, CRP, C-reactive protein and fibrinogen, CRP and fibrinogen. So these, this was our first session with respect to main three topics for revision before the NEAT PG segment. We will be, please do give me a thumbs up or like the video. If you are comfortable, if you are comfortable, we will be discussing these topics at this speed only. This is your crash course revision module with respect to the NEAT PG segment. This is sort of a demo also. This is the way, this is the way the crash course is being conducted on the NEAT PG plus platform. Of course, it is chapter wise in the in the revision batch. It is chapter wise versus when I'm doing the sessions on YouTube, I'm picking out the main main subject, main main topics and we'll be doing the three topics per video, three topics per video. This is the crash course format. Next, we'll supplement it with MCQ based revision. So three things, three things which are there in the educator batch. That is the crash course, MCQ based revision and grant us of course and grant us you can avail up to 20 percent discounts on all subscriptions by using the code patho ua but whatever it is whatever it is keep on working keep on slogging friends keep on slogging things are going to work out beautifully so we'll be continuing we'll be continuing with our three topic sessions in pathology till the paper till the paper Thank you, thank you and take care. Best of luck.